What's up everybody, Doug at Big Kid Power Sports, and today we're gonna teach you how to save a couple bucks on your snowmobile registration and trail passes for Illinois and Wisconsin. So we're gonna be right at that border right there. A lot of Illinois guys go up to Wisconsin. Not so much Wisconsin guys coming down to Illinois. So thinking about it, this is really gonna revolve around Wisconsin, right at the border. We'll start off with an Illinois resident. If you're an Illinois resident and you ride in Illinois, you don't go to Wisconsin, you just bang some ditches around here, well that's an easy one. Register your sled with Illinois, that's 30 bucks for three years, so we're going to make it nice and sweet, something to compare back and forth, that's 10 bucks a year. Simple math, that, I mean, it is what it is, okay? Trail systems in Illinois, that's a whole other subject, we'll do a different video about that, but let's continue. So you're an Illinois resident, and you like to ride in Wisconsin. You do a little riding in Illinois. All right, here we go. Logically, you would register your sled still in Illinois. That's that $10 a year. It's actually a three-year deal, but like I said, $10 a year. Now you're going to get a Wisconsin Trail Pass, because you're going to be riding up in Wisconsin. So non-resident Wisconsin Trail Pass is 50 bucks a year. That's 60 bucks a year. Okay, there's not really many numbers to fudge around with that. This is how you're gonna save a couple bucks. If you don't ride in Illinois, then you don't have to register in Illinois. A lot of people don't understand that, that I'm an Illinois resident, I got an Illinois driver's license, I live in Illinois. You think that you have to register it in Illinois. But if you don't ride in Illinois, then don't do it. Register it in Wisconsin, so now you, that's a 30, same deal, $30 for three years, so 10 bucks a year. But at this point, now you've got a sled registered in Wisconsin. So when you go to buy a trail pass for Wisconsin, residential, or uh, you know, a resident trail pass is 30 bucks. So you're at 40 bucks. Like I said, if you don't ride in Illinois, don't do Illinois, you just saved yourself 20 bucks. Not bad, not bad. Most people have two sleds, right? You got uh, yours, you got the wife's, or you just got yours and a spare, whatever the case may be. Like, a, you know, when we were talking about Illinois, there's not really many numbers to fudge there. It's 20 bucks a year. 30 bucks, two, $30, three year passes, broken down per year, that's 20 bucks. So, doing our little trick, you register them up in Wisconsin, I don't ride around here anyway, so what's the deal? Trailering these things up into Wisconsin somewhere, get a little trip into Crivets or something, you know? So you get your two sleds. You register them both in Wisconsin, 10 bucks a year, broken down. So that's 20 bucks a year you're at. Now, you are, it's a Wisconsin sled, so you're gonna get the trail pass, and that would be the 30 bucks. So that's 60 bucks. You're at 80 bucks. All right, not bad, not bad. You know, we broke down the system there. Yeah, 80 bucks. Here's another couple, there's another spot. You can save some dough. You got your sleds registered in Wisconsin. Join a Wisconsin snowmobile club. They don't have to be, I mean, you can pick whatever club you want. If you really want to crunch some numbers, find a club that's got low fees or whatever the case may be, join that club. Join a club that's close to the area that you ride in. I mean, that club makes, makes the money. All that money goes towards grooming the trails, the trails that you ride and love and go to and flock to every year. So that makes sense. You know, join a club if you live... Close to the border, join a club just over the border. You can enjoy uh, the club, you know, uh, annual events or whatever it may be for club members only. I know there's one right over the border that does like a pig roast. You get free beer and pig. Uh, that sounds delicious. That sounds like a no-brainer. This is how we're going to do it. So you got your sleds. Register them both in Wisconsin. 20 bucks, right? 10 bucks a year. Two sleds. 20 bucks. And then uh, since you're a member of the club, which might have been 30 bucks to join, right? 
So you're at 40 bucks. Uh, it doesn't matter how many sleds you run, as long as you are a member of a club. It's 10 bucks a year per sled for a Wisconsin Trail Pass. So with two sleds, you're at 20 bucks. It was 30 bucks to join the club. That's 50 bucks. 70 bucks. Yeah, you saved another 10 bucks. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. So that's where you're starting to start saving some money. Because now if you got three sleds, if you got four sleds, it's only 10 more dollars per sled per trail pass. So you're saving money exponentially, you know, as many so you got a whole fleet of sleds going up there. Ooh, saving some money. So that's the key right there. If you got two or more sleds, join a Wisconsin snowmobile club. You're gonna save money on the trail pass. You're gonna have a little more up front because you're gonna be joining a club. There's gonna be dues, but if you do it right, you can join a club where you can actually utilize some of the uh, benefits of being in that club and, you know, pick a club that supports and handles the trails that you like. It's a win-win for everyone. So that's how you're going to save some money and uh, enjoy the sport a little more.